And speaking of features, we would be kicking ourselves if we didn't pull you up on a tweet. Someone that you put <laughs> out, oh, shit. out the other day. Okay. Which... <laughs> so to quote yeah. yourself, that <laughs> you have worked alongside Vessel from Sleep Token, but that collaboration will never see the light of day. Yeah. So, um, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so basically, I'm not baiting, by the way. This is completely true. I, I got to be honest. I, I didn't realize how much of a stir it caused when I tweeted it because it's got like an insane view count on it. It's because um, Sleep Token but, are like the biggest stand in the world right yeah, now. Yeah, so I know. Like... Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I guess it was bait in a way, but um, but yeah, basically just to just to put it to bed. Uh, during the pandemic, myself and Vessel just chatted, and, and we've been friends. Um, the second ever Sleep Token show was supporting us and Load. Oh, so, uh, you know, really from the inception, Sleep Token of, of kind of we've been there and they've been there. You know, so um, we you know we share the same manager and stuff. So there's there's lots of through threads, but um, yeah, we we did a collab on a song. But, um, I, I, the less I say, the less annoying it'll be over the years to <laughs> to, to knock it away. But uh, yeah, we did a collab and um, it was very much like first takes, you know what I mean? And just bouncing back and forth. Um, and nothing ended up coming of it, but um, it was really good. Yeah, and, I, uh, don't, I really don't doubt that for a second. To have been a fly on the wall <laughs> in that studio, two of the most beautiful voices in modern music sitting down and fucking around for a little bit. Are you kidding me? Thank you. I appreciate it. I'm grateful to be put up there with, with him, you know, but uh, I will say though, you know, it was very much a, a computer, you know, you sent me a yeah, demo. I'll yeah. Send you yeah. He said it was back. over lockdown. Wasn't kind of it? So, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. Right. You know, but I mean, I, more than anything, I'm being quite stern about it because I know sleep tokens secrecy is so important, yeah, you know, and they're good friends of ours. And I feel, I actually feel bad even mentioning it because I, I hate the thought of it looking like I'm baiting some like traffic or whatever. Um, but sadly, I, I really don't think they would ever want it out there. And I don't think we would either because it's just a bit random, but it was great and it exists. And, uh, <laughs> so, I think it's only on my computer. So there's just you and Vessel <laughs> sat there with something that there inevitably would be millions of people around the world. There's some, some studying <laughs> hacking right now. There's some, some emo <laughs> hacker right now. Just trying to get into your, get your <laughs> get IP in address. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, speaking of being on the, the same manager and a sleep token, one thing that I did want to ask you is the fact that obviously there is a Wembley date that is sold out that needs a, needs a support band. And I mean, I can't, I can't imagine a better support band to warm up for sleep token at Wembley than you guys. I think um, it's interesting because I respect sleep token so much. I wouldn't even offer if that makes sense, because yeah. I know that they are so just in control and and i would and i know for a fact i mean part of me likes to think that they won't even they won't even like um have a support have a support i, I, I think that'd be that. hard as fuck yeah. also can i just say i man i'm so shocked that people didn't turn up the heavy music awards and like in some way announce this Wembley show. That would have been so, the night before, the week before whatever, they won an award at Wembley. Yeah. 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 And I was, they announced the show. I was, I was like, like just I, turn up mask. I don't know, hold up a date and leave. Yeah. Cause I was yeah, like, just like, yeah. even like, if you want to pro wrestling it, like have it on the visualizer on the LED screens at the yeah. back, just like <laughs> arms in the air, Undertaker style. Just have like a fake voice. <laughs> Church bells bonging in the background. <laughs> Even do like the lightning bolt down to the stage yeah. and then he like disappears. <laughs> uh, he just, run, yeah, he I, just I, runs I, out uh, the back. <laughs> uh, I can confirm that, uh, yeah, we, we probably definitely won't be on that. But it would be great. But I also think back to it as well. You know, like I said about Electric Callboy, some bands' fan bases are just so theirs that, you know, you know, I think it'd be hard to support a band like Sleep Token anyway. You know, because no, I mean, nobody, nobody's turned up for anything other than worship, you know? So. I mean, you like, uh, as I said, if it was to be any band, like to go alongside like musically, what you get from a sleep token performance after seeing you guys live, like the fit on that bill would be perfect. Cause I mean, like if you're going to expect a headliner with a beautiful voice, kind of on the support band to have a singer with a beautiful voice as well. So you tick every box necessary to support sleep token. Thank you. I appreciate that. I think I think we're closer than 
I am. I think we get credit for almost sometimes because, like, you know, when I listen to their their music, sometimes I'm like, <clears throat> you know, these are demos that I send sometimes, you know. But it's like I think it's just the spaces we operate in are, are almost different, even if we do them almost kind of similarly, I guess. Yeah. But yeah, but um, good for them though. No legends, and it's so cool that a band that didn't need any sort of persona blew up it, from the UK as well. You know, you talk about the holy trinity of metalcore. You've got now you've got Bad Omen, Spirit Box, and and, and a British yeah. band, you know, so which is cool as hell. 